What's up? I'm looking at looking at these figs. Blow it up, maybe you can see it a little better. Figs are symbols of Saturn. Look. The fig tree is the third tree to be mentioned in the Hebrew Bible. It is it is the tree the first is the tree of life, the second is the tree of knowledge of good and evil. And Adam and Eve used the fig tree to sew garments for themselves. Now look, the promised land is a land of wheat and barley, vines, and fucking fig trees. Alright? You may not think much of this. You may call me crazy, you know, but whatever. I really don't care. But, uh, we have Jesus cursing the fig tree. Now, say what you want. Why the hell did he curse a fig tree? It wasn't because some fucking people weren't bearing fruit. It's because he didn't want people eating from the tree of Saturn. Like Adam and Eve did. You think they put those fucking fig leaves on to hide their nakedness? No. They put those fig leaves on because they ate from that tree. And once they did that, they took on physicality. You know, they were they they put on the leaf of the tree of Saturn. And and there they were. So let me just show you. Uh Shani. Shani Dev. Shani refers to the planet Saturn. Right? <laughs> Look. The fig tree or Pipal is the abode of Shani. Saturn is where he lives. Go eat some. Fucking fig newtons. Get it? Isaac Newton deifies Noah as Saturn. So they so the, the the cookies are named after Isaac Newton. And the figs are from Saturn. Look here. Look. It was custom to offer figs to Saturn as it was said as he was said to have discovered figs. Okay? Blow that up so you can see it. Custom in ancient times to make an offering of figs to Saturn as he was said to have discovered figs. Okay? Got it? Now, let's go up here. Um, let's find some other shit. Buddha, the fig tree, is a symbol of enlightenment. Buddha achieved enlightenment while sitting under a fig tree. One of the titans who fled from Zeus, which is Saturn, was transformed by his mother into a fig tree. Alright. Greek mythology. Figs are associated with Bacchus. Saturn. Alright. Let me show you guys a verse. I'm sure you're probably familiar with. Well, you may not be, but let me show it to you anyway. Because it's a great verse. Judges 9-11. Ha! But the fig tree replied, Should I give up my fruit so good and sweet to hold sway over the trees? A talking fig tree, huh? When are you guys going to fucking wake up, man? The fig tree was cursed because, I mean... Stretch your mind around it, but it's a metaphor to the people eating of that tree. Okay? Now, we'll make a follow-up video to this, but I just wanted to get this 
you know, just make a video about this little bit right now because, I mean, it's, it's really interesting. Look here. Jesus was hungry, seeing in the distance a fig tree and leaf. He went to find out if it had any fruit. When he reached it, he found nothing but leaves because it wasn't the season for figs. He, this is the most important part right here. May no one eat from you again. Alright. He didn't want nobody eating from the Saturn tree anymore. But yet here we are. Gobbling down fig newtons. My kids brought this home. See this? They got this at school. Raise L's. It's like a fig, right? Raisins. Anyway, that's enough. I'll make another follow-up video later.